Yo, what's up guys? I'm Charis and welcome to a new video. Today we're doing another dream requirement uh, mini guide. So this time we're doing the Ice Ice Chimp requirement, which is to complete 25 Chimp Ice deliveries. And if you don't know what this is, don't worry about it because you're going to learn right now. As per usual, I'm just going to assume you have a completion escape or in this case, this is also a requirement for the Master Quest Cape. So you probably or definitely already have the quest you need to do this, which is do no evil. So we're gonna just skip over those requirements. As for the items that you need, you need bandit camp teleports, which after you use them will teleport you right here in the middle of the bandit camp. You also need ice barrage runes, which are uh, blood and water runes. And also you need to be on the ancient spell block in order to cast ice barrage. Then you need a monkey Grigory. It doesn't really matter which one. I just have the monkey one right now. And you also need to have uh, the air hot balloon route unlocked to the grand tree. And for that, you will be needing one magic log every time you do it. So if you're doing this from the beginning, you need 25 in total. You can go bank in the middle. Each run is independent, so don't worry about that. I just have three magic logs right here. Also, you need the Kremula in order to talk to monkeys. And finally, you don't need this, but they're pretty useful. I have a dual wield melee, so I can use bladed dive. If you have that unlocked, it's going to make the trips a lot shorter. And also, I have mobile on my offense so that bladed dive and search recharge faster so to start a run you're gonna teleport to the bandit camp using your scrolls and it'll take you right here after this you're gonna surge and bladed dive over this way with mobile you'll be able to bladed dive and search once more before you get to where you have to go so you want to go over here where the monkeys are at and again you can surge and bladed dive and you're going to right click this monkey right here and click bite chimp ice once you have that, you have one minute until it melts, so you have to cast Ice Barrage on it before it melts so that it uh, restores the cooldown. It won't, it won't go over one minute, so you have to be quick. So after you get it, you're going to right click this monkey and, and hit Fast Travel to Shantae Pass. Once you get to Shantae Pass, you're going to spam flip your map and go over to Alkarid. Once you're here, you're going to search once more and then let it dive over this way. And then you want to freeze your monkey by clicking on it or your not your monkey, but your chimp ice by clicking on it and then using ice barrage. Then you're going to run over here. You're going to search once more, use your bladed dive. And then you're going to go to the dungeoneering place. Just right click this guy and click sail. Once you get here, you're going to right click him back and then you're going to take it to Taverly. So you're going to hit number two. And once in Taverly, you're going to run over here again, bladed dive as much as you can. Also, you can surge and run over to the hotter balloon over here in Taverly. Once at the hotter balloon, you're going to click fly and go to the grand tree. This is where you need the magic lock and it'll use one up. Once you get to the magic tree, you're going to click your chimp ice and freeze it again with ice barrage number four. And then you're going to blade it dive and then surge over to the door. Then you're going to climb up the stairs, go over to the bar and look for, I don't even know what it, what he's called. I'll tell you here in a second once I find him. Should be somewhere around here. There he is, that hero. And you're going to right click him and click travel. At this point, you just want to hold your one key down and you're going to be traveling around. Then you're gonna to go to Waydar, right click travel, which will take you to the crash island. And then finally, you're gonna to talk to Lumdo, right click travel, and it'll take you to Apatol. Once at Apatol, you wanna run over to the entrance. So over here is a little bit trickier to surge and bladed dive, so you can just get used to it. You won't get the full thing, but it's still useful to have it. So. Once you get over here, you're going to come close to the door. And as soon as you're really close to the door, you're going to click the chimp ice, freeze it with the ice barrage, and then wear your monkey Grigri in order to turn into a monkey. And then you're just going to quickly run over to the gate and open it. Once at Apatol, you're going to run over behind this building. And once you're Behind this building, you're going to equip your Dragor Longsword and then freeze the Chimp Ice one last time before the delivery ends. So, Dragor, and then Ice Barrage, back to being a monkey. And that's the last time you're going to freeze it for this run. So, you're going to run over to the king. 
and talk first you have to talk to the elder guard outside in order for to go in and then once you talk to him you'll get inside of the building and you can talk to Awowoge or whatever the king's name is at this point you're safe you made the delivery you just have to go through the dialogue and he'll give you some reward it's nothing that you really want but that's the delivery done then you're going to teleport to bandit camp and this is where you start over. Don't forget to equip your augmented dragger, your augment, your dragger main hand or whatever you have for bladed dive, so that you can use it when you're going back to the monkey. Couple things to know: if you use ice brush on the chimp ice, it will reset the timer for about one minute. But if you for some reason don't have 94 magic, you can also use ice burst, which will reset the timer for about 45 seconds. Ice Blitz, which will reset the time for about 35 seconds. And finally, Ice Rush, which will reset the time for about 25 seconds. If you're doing this with Ice Rush, you're probably going to get really annoyed with a lot of Melted Chimp Ices, so I wouldn't recommend it. The second thing to know is that you have to pay attention to your chat because you get two messages warning you that your Chimp Ice is about to melt. The first one is 20 seconds before it melts, and it says your Chimp Ice is beginning to melt. And then 10 seconds after that, so 10 seconds before it melts, you will receive the message, your chimpas has nearly melted. Third note is that every fifth delivery, the chimpas will only last for half the time and the effects of the ice build will only increase the timer by about half. So you wanna be on the lookout for this fifth once and be really paying attention so that you don't lose any of the ice creams. The run that you're seeing right now is one of those fifth ones. So you can see me freezing my chimpas a lot more often. And remember, it's better to be safe than sorry, so even in the regular runs, the method that I show you is using the absolute least amount of freezes. So don't worry about that, just freeze it as often as you have to, and it's better to freeze it a lot more than to waste time by having an ice cream melt. Anyways guys, that's it for this video. I hope that this guide helped you out, and if it did, let me know in the comments. If you have any questions as well, just let, leave them down below. Other than that, you can like the video and subscribe to my channel, click on the button right below my name, and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya!